proud to bring you the best comedians our town has to offer. offer. And our next guest is a no-nonsense comic that's not afraid to tell it like it is. Robert Duchesne brings his routine to the world-famous improv at Harris tonight through Sunday. Showtimes are at 8.30 nightly with additional 10 o'clock shows on Friday and Saturday. Now here's Robert. Woo! Yeah, yeah Robert! How you guys doing out there? Let's get <laughs> this over with. <laughs> sorry, sorry. I don't know why I start my show like that. I'm a little cranky. I didn't really expect to live this long. <sighs> every day's a gift, though, right? That's, that's what happy people love to tell you when you're feeling down. Just remember, every day's a gift. Just wake up in the morning, just make it through another gift. <laughs> my luck will live to be 100. I like it when each news magazine shows bring people on and wish them a happy 100th birthday. Those people ever look happy to you? <laughs> wow, you're 100. Tell us, what's your secret? I can't die. <laughs> Muscle crank. I got noisy neighbors. I got to move. I haven't had much sleep. Hoping to move next to a serial killer if I can. They're always so nice and quiet. Uh, Keep to themselves. Certain traits you can look for 25 to 35. White. Male. It's almost always men. Hardly ever see a woman serial killer. I think that's because women generally like to kill one man slowly. <laughs> over many, many long years. They call that holy matrimony for some reason. I'm just teasing women, though. It's just a joke. Uh -huh. Women are doing well these days, right? Uh -huh. Two women just uh, passed the Rangers. Uh, yeah. Yes. That's not easy to do. They're going to put a woman on a $10 bill? Duh. You hear about that? Putting a woman on a $10 bill? It's only going to be worth seven twenty now. <laughs> but, <laughs> no, that's not my... I don't set the currency rates. I'm saying that's what uh, feminists say. That it's, that pay less. But uh, people, people love... Uh, this pet thing has gotten a little out of hand, I think. A uh, friend of mine told me the other day that he rescued a dog. He rescued a dog? It's amazing. Tell me the story. What happened? What'd you... Oh, you drove to the pound and picked it up? Hey, could you rescue me from the airport on Sunday? <laughs> no? Too much traffic for you, hero? No, I get it. Guess I got to start working out. I don't, I don't mean right now. No, I'm stuck in that. I'm just, uh, Doctor told me I got to start doing cardiovascular exercise to get the heart rate up. I've always had a theory when it comes to working out hard, though. My theory is, yeah, I'm not going to do that. I'm not going <laughs> to. I'll just tell people I'm 70. <laughs> hey, you look pretty good for 70. Well, I take care of myself. <laughs> Thank you, guys. Come on out to the Yay! improv today. Appreciate it. Thank you so much, yeah. Robert.